again. It's been quite a long time since I've uploaded. Um, I don't remember the last time I uploaded. My memory's not that good. I'm going to basically fill you in on everything that's been happening and I'm once again coming back on the channel, going to start making videos because I've actually had a few people on Instagram um, coming to my Instagram and telling me that I should start making videos again and that they miss my videos. So that's what we're doing. We're coming back. I've got new plans for the channel which I'm very excited to tell you about because I think they're going to be great videos and I'm really looking forward to making them. This week has been one of the busiest weeks of my entire life, or last week, sorry, last week. Because I got a new dog. Yeah, a new dog, wow, all great fun. New dogs are supposed to be really great, you know, a good time for all the family. No. This was the dog. I'm not sure if you can see that, can you see that? That was the dog, um, he was called Sonny and he was a, a Husky Cross Malamute Cross Czech Wolf Dog. He was 17 months old um, and we thought we could take him on because he needed rehoming because this woman was moving house and she couldn't take the dog with her. So we said, oh we'll rehome him because he looks lovely. Um, she said he got on with other dogs and we thought great we'll take on this dog, this big fluffy dog, we'll have a big dog in because our dog is like tiny, he's like a weasel. Took him on and basically to cut a long story short he didn't get on with our dog we have already. Um, he started being very vicious towards him and he wasn't being vicious towards him, he was playing but his playing, his jaw is like this big and Marley's entire body can fit inside his mouth so the way Sonny played with Marley, Marley didn't like because he was too rough. Rough, rough, get it? Because rough, 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 like a dog, rough. Um, so yeah, he was too rough for Marley and Marley didn't really like it. Um, Marley was unhappy and they attacked each other a couple of times until Marley was actually bleeding and injured. Um, they went for me a couple times as well, which is not on because obviously if that progresses it can turn into aggression towards humans and that's not good. Tried everything, absolutely everything, you know, we are very into the um, Caesar Milan dog whisperer type of behaviour but nothing worked on this dog, he was just, he wouldn't take no for an answer nor from us, not from us nor from Marley. Um, you know, Marley could go at him and he just didn't give two dams, like he, he just literally couldn't care less. He was just like, alright, what are you doing you weasel dog, like you're really not harming me, so come on playtime. It wasn't working out between them, so he had to go on Sunday, but it was very stressful. Um, I barely slept, I started to feel ill because I was so stressed out because these dogs were like non-stop at each other. Um, I was having to keep watch of them all the time, like Marley was getting injured, which for me is not very nice to see because... I've owned Marley since he was nine weeks old and now he's four years old. So he's grown up with us and I've grown up with him in a way because I'm only young as well. Constant like keeping watch of the dogs in case they hurt each other and it was not, it was very stressful. Um, so Sunny left on Sunday so I had a new dog and then I didn't have a new dog. So now I don't have a new dog anymore. I have my one dog, Marley. Okay, there was that and then also I went through a breakup last week. Um, it was basically just um, a means of him saying a bunch of hurtful things to me, things I would never have guessed he would say to me, um, made me feel really bad about myself and also struggle to trust people now after what he did because, you know, he said he loved me for who I am and all this crap and comes back and tells me that he doesn't like the way I act and that I'm immature and childish and stupid and that my behaviour is pathetic, so it's kind of like, I don't know, um, it was really harsh on me to hear that coming from him, um, so he's gone, he's broke, no more, I unfriended him on Snapchat, um, it's just not, it's not worth it, you know, like, if, you, if someone who's not going to appreciate you for who you are, they may as well just get lost, honestly. Okay, I act silly sometimes, but like, as I said on my Snapchat story, I'm not a 30 year old woman, like I'm still a child and I'm quite entitled to act like a child, you know, I am mature, I'm intelligent, I have common sense, like when I'm 18 and I move out and I need all this intelligent stuff I will use it, but for now I'm a freaking child 
and I like to be loud and stupid and obnoxious because that's who I am if you don't like it. <laughs> That was really, really difficult because on top of the dog and everything, it was like, I cried for like an hour, I kid you not. Um, so yeah, there was that. That's kind of the main things, to be honest, it's been taking up my time and demotivating me from filming. I feel like I want to say so much more and that I have more to say, but I don't... Now it comes to it, I'm like... Eh? What? Oh, I'm also going to start college in September. I've been looking into it and they've got an open day in May. Um, I've been looking at the types of courses I want to do and what is required of me to get into college. Um, I've been looking into that a lot recently and I think I'm going to go into creative studies. Um, which is basically all kinds of art, like art, painting, ceramics, uh, photography as well. Different kinds of like arts basically because I'm really into art. And for me, I don't want to do a job where I'm sat in an office or like sat down doing paperwork and stuff like that. Like, no thanks, that would be death, basically. I want to do a job where I can be creative every single day. So if college can kind of open me up to all kinds of different arts, maybe I can decide if I want to do kind of like animation or ceramics. Maybe I want to do ceramics, like one of those old pottery men. Oh. Um, it's quite fun, like, yeah, anyway. <laughs> I'm looking into college and hopefully I'm going to go to college in September for a year, which will be great as well. A lot, of, of, a lot of things have been happening, a lot of stress, a lot of tears and anxiety. Anxiety. What, what am I want to watch? For my channel, I'm going to start making videos. Um, as for my channel, yeah. My mum gave me this idea, she said I should do like unsolved mysteries. So what I'm going to do basically on the channel, I'm not going to be doing this every single day by the way, I'm still going to be doing like BTS videos and some like sit down Q&A maybe type videos, but this is going to be, um, these are going to be on the channel as well. I'm going to be doing unsolved mystery type videos, um, looks into murders that haven't been solved and looks into kind of the theories and the stories and different things like that. So I've been looking into some unsolved mysteries like unsolved murders, like paranormal murder type things and um, I'm really interested by them so I'm going to start making videos on them, sharing my thoughts, theories um, about the unsolved like paranormal murders and or paranormal murders and that's kind of what I'm going to be doing as well on the channel so stick around if you want to see that then stick around because I'm very excited for it actually so I keep like bloody my glasses I swear to god oh now my battery's flashing shit <laughs> that's all for this video um that's kind of what I wanted to say I wanted to give you like a life update and stuff and tell you what I want to be filming Look out for more videos, I'm going to be filming the rest of the week most probably and uploading. This is a weird time because it's like Tuesday. This might not be up until Wednesday because I have like so many things to do but anyway. For this video, um, I'm not really even going to say I hope you enjoyed it because there's not much to enjoy about an update video. Um, but anyway, give it a like if you did like it. Um, my social medias are all linked in the description bar below. If you want to head over and follow them, I suggest you do. Thank you in advance. Subscribe to the channel as well because, you know, new content, new things, I'm coming back, people. Hey okay, guys, once again, I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. Look out for the new videos. Uh, remember to stay positive and I'll see you all in the next one.